Hey, what's up, guys? In case you guys don't know, I'm Joseph Fly, and we are about to go to the Vizio bus, in which we're gonna play I'm gonna be the show, and hopefully go 12 and 0 without Zoe. That's what it is. We invited him, he didn't want to come, I don't know why. If you could drop a pin, that would be fantastic. Oh man, a pin? A pin would be great. A pin would be um, awesome. Yeah. Look at this. This is art. You need. You think it's real water? Well, I think it's real water. Confirmed. I'll be honest, I need to get out in the city more because I don't even know. I don't even, I've never been here. It's your first time, Joe's. First time here. Thanks to the Vizio bus. At the Vizio Helix. Let's go. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Have a good one, guys. Is that like a super New York accent? Is that Jack's farm? That was awesome. I'm pretty excited. I like technology. There's been a lot of anticipation about the Vizio bus. Tom is the busy of us. This is his dream. Food truck across from the bus? Oh, yeah. How are we going to cross the street? Just bomb it? New York City! <laughs> Woohoo! Flying squirrels. Very good friend of mine, Lou DiBella, owns this team. Um, they sent us some stuff. Look at this. We got a hat. This hat's sick. Are you serious? What? Is this squirrel ball? I can get food out of the oven now, out of the air fryer we have in the kitchen. Oh, wow, ball. You want to like practice like drills, just like with that? Let me, let me show you how to field the ground ball. I learned. You need this. This is the, the building ground ball. I learned from my game one. <laughs> Just gotta get the blow down. That felt all hey. too familiar. Good fun. Good fun. <laughs> Floor 14 gonna hate us. It's like made out of cork. Yes. <laughs> this is a Jimmy hat. Oh, yes. I've never seen him wear red, Jimmy, but I think it's a nice little, nice little score. You us. like official ball? I keep the box. Oh, this was kind of like official ball of the minor league. Yeah, Jack has the box. Awesome. Oh, Jack in a box, sitting it like a cat. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Fine Not Squirrel. In the box. <laughs> Thanks, Lou. Oh, that's cool. Bob Canobio is a one percent owner, so therefore I am inheriting this team one day. That was very grim. <laughs> It's really a replay score, but always going to be the main. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, even this was like not difficult to put together. Because not a lot of you might die players. Yes. Yeah. yeah. The yeah. audio yeah. was like crisp. It was oh, super yeah. easy. It's awesome. We didn't even do that much with it. Cool. Um, All right. I guess the one main question we have is how much of the intro to keep in. Okay. Um, right now, the first pitch is at like six ten, which feels late to me. Yeah. I was gonna say I would I would much rather back end uh, a time and then work within that constraint. Yeah. Like, yeah. I was gonna say shorter than six. Um, yeah. And this was already like, how much is there? Bit. Yeah, that's that's a long time. Yeah, I, I, some of it is like rules-based stuff, which okay. maybe for game one, we might wanna leave in. Yeah, I would wonder for games two and three, like how long it is, because I hope they're not six minutes there too, because I would, like one minute is where I was gonna say. So we'll maybe game one trying. can be longer. Game one can be longer. But, I don't know, I'm gonna cut and show you, we can see. All right, but yeah, I would, I would try to say a minute for game the rest, unless it's impossible. All right. You guys have done a good job at this without all the three, because I know that a lot of those he talked for longer. Yeah, well, we just basically said, hey, this is Chris Rose, this is Blitzball Battle 3, presented by Shady Rays. First pitch. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's pretty good. Though. Best we can do. All right. I swear, Jake just hides all the good stuff in plain sight because he doesn't want to share his cushy dreams. But well, you know what? I do want to share. I want to share with you guys because cushy dreams, quite possibly, some of the greatest gummies I've ever had. They have pre-rolls, they have flour, and they have THC gummies, which, as you can see, not only do they look great, but they taste great and they feel great. And that's why Jake Storielli always hides these in plain sight. And truthfully, it's just pissing me off. I'm not gonna gatekeep. 
I'm gonna give you a code because you're watching the office vlog. You wanna hang out with us, we wanna hang out with you. Use code JOHNBOY for 25% off your order of Cushy Dreams. So you can get some of these gummies, we have some of these gummies, and we can all just like virtually hang out. That is cushydreams.com, K-U-S-H-Y.com. Use code JOHNBOY, 25% off, cool? So we're speaking at a panel, on a panel, at a panel, on a panel at Fordham University for sports media. And we got picked. We got picked. Uh, I don't know. So first of all, we have Pax Melrod. She's a content creator at Jumboy Media. She's one of the hosts of the Girls & Co podcast and is heavily featured in most Jumboy entertainment content, as well as being part of the broadcast team on the Warehouse Games. So. Here it up for the Next up, we have Jack Oliver, who is also known as Jolly Olive. He has his own YouTube channel that is currently uh, at 68.5 thousand subscribers and has become a part of the Jumboy Media Network. And he also hosts the Shea Station podcast with former Mets pitcher Jerry Blevins. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow, vlogging. Oh wow, vlogging. Oh wow. That's how you start off the vlog. Is it gonna be crowded? Watch this. Um, birds. There's birds. No, it won't be crowded. Oh, really? I kind of crowded more than I thought right here. Oh, those guys are taking a picture. Came out nice. Yeah. Just cut that way. Yeah. This is our friend. He's got relatives in Australia. See you later. This is a vlog. I don't want mid. I don't want midday pasta. You know. Yeah, that's aggressive. They've got Like, this is falafel. I think I want to try that. I always go to the food over there, but I feel dumb. Because it's like, what's that? Like, I'm like, I'm scared. I've never done that. Do I have a seafood dish? No, a seafood. You have to use your hands a lot. And I was fighting with the lobster claw last time, and it just felt not cool. You talk me into it. I'll get the lobster. All right, tell everyone what you got for Maddie. With the full seafood plate, sushi... Whatever those are. And then I got a little burger just in case I wasn't satisfied. I went shortest line. Is that a, is that a flatbread pizza? Or yeah. That? Sicilian. That's Sicilian. DiGiorno. Thank you. I did that last time I was here and I was just like, it's so much work. The lobster tails. Is that what we're doing? No nose picking. No, uh, head down on the phone. I didn't lose yet. Yeah. The Yankees are winning. Excited to see Davey? I love Davey. Up close and in person? My guy guy. Oh,
serious vibrato. They're watching the game. And we're watching them watching the game. Jake's No, Jake's I can't, I'll be honest, I don't have my glasses on, I can't even see them there's from a, here. There's a seam of the right in front of Oh, this is Jake. Jake, oh. it's my, Jake oh, hates when he's cool. eating on TV. I know them. Why does Jake look so much smaller than Jimmy? <laughs> Jake looks like a legitimate child. Yeah. Like, Jake looks like his first game. his legs. They were the also air. so worried about wearing merch that shows like our name and you can't see. You should wear a hat. Anything. I think, I think Jimmy's Jimmy wearing a hat. Yeah. Jake needs to get a cotton candy. Yeah, Jimmy has is that them? That's Jake, that, tell me how old Jake looks. <laughs> <laughs> he looks 19. <laughs> Pretty good. Oh, that's so offensive to them. <laughs> oh, no. Just pounding they're, food. They're just talking heads. Who are these guys? These guys are chucking, chuckling up a little bit, a bit too much for my life. Jake's cracking jokes. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Did you imagine? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, the guy's like, sir, you can't have an infant. In <laughs> By the seventh inning. Yo, that Andrew Allen tweeting Jake forgot his booster seat. <laughs> That is brutal. Oh my they god. They made that wall yeah. too high. I'm getting confused. Yeah, it's true. No, they made no, the there's, too there's short. seats are just lower. The 